Is that parsley? That is not parsley. Does that look like parsley to you? No. Does this look like parsley to you? <laughs> no. It's like dill or something. Oh, okay. Parsley. Is it's it dill? dill yes. Okay. Wait, green beans? Are these snow peas? No, these are green beans. Okay. Mayo. We got beef bouillon. I think this is for uh, the peppercorn sauce. You put beef in the sauce? Yes. And then you put it on the beef? Yes. Mm -hmm. These carnivores, man. We got Dijon mustard, garlic, and what else? Potatoes. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay. We got potatoes. I love the small potatoes. Where's the plastic wrapping? They don't have plastic wrapping. I'm joking. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Preheat the oven for 50 Fahrenheit. Uh... 450 Fahrenheit is hot. The skill, the accuracy, precision. I'm not saying the speed, because there is no speed, but you know. Uh, yeah, I gave the potatoes yeah. just a very loose rinse. I thought we would uh, peel them, but this is this is whole potatoes. It's very thin skin. Yeah, this, uh, this knife is very satisfying. I won't lie though. Well, I would expect it to be. Yeah. Okay. It, like, it, it, it cuts through this like butter. So for the potatoes, it's cut into one inch pieces, tossed potatoes with one tablespoon of oil. oil and probably salt and pepper. On a parchment paper, line baking sheet, season with salt and pepper, roast in the middle of the oven until golden brown, 25 to 28 minutes. That's the big one, that's why we're doing it first. Yep. So we've got, we've got to be timely about this thing. Get that oiled up there. There we go. Dunk them in. And we're gonna season a little bit here. I mean, it is still preheating, but it's very close, so it's fine. Look, look, look how fast I am. Please don't go any, don't do that. You're gonna need those fingers to cook more things at hey. a later time. It's doing okay. You know, it's not too bad. You're eating it. It's steak time. Salt alarm never. Ah, that was hot in my face. All right. <sighs> camera much closer. You have to, yeah, you have to get it to the camera. It looks pretty good. Okay. Hmm. I'll keep it looks like the sauce proper here. steak. Yeah, you're tearing your. Oh no, the grain is there. So I'm cutting like that. I mean, you do have like a 9,000 damage sword. I mean, you can you can yeah. probably just cut on the grain even if you're not supposed to. It's just it's just too sharp. Okay. 
Des- just think. Describe, describe scent. Am I supposed to smell it like wine first? Mm-hmm. It's meaty, garlicky, and very peppery, and I love it. Okay. Describe taste. Describe. Stop chewing. Describe. It is really nice too. The steak is soft. It's not chewy, which really puts me off when um, a steak is chewy. It is a tiny bit cold because we took a while painting it and photographing it, but that's fine. You don't have to take photos, but it's very tender. Yeah. And this sauce with the potatoes is amazing. Apparently the trick is to microwave the plate while the steak is on so it stays warm. Microwave the plate. Oh, you could. Yeah, but we don't Should have Should we one. get a microwave just to microwave plates? Fun fact, the, mor- the morons don't own a microwave. It's the Morrisons. <laughs> okay, I'll get in the camera. So, what, what's she in there? I'm so sorry, you can't have that. Can I watch? Yes. Mmm. Mmm. Amazing. Could you describe the feelings the cow <laughs> had for me while you eat it, please? <laughs> Was it sad? No. Oh. You didn't know. <laughs> Crips fantasy is watching people eat meat. <laughs> is the potato good? I'm sorry, it's very good. I'm sorry. I- <laughs> is the potato good because it tastes like potato or because it... T- tastes like the liquefied beef that we put on the potatoes. No. This sauce is amazing. Okay. Why would it be overcooked? The, the, the steak was, I would say, closer to medium rare than medium. Um, but, like, before I went vegan, I would have my steaks medium. So I would, I, I would not consider this overcooked whatsoever. No, he's asking about the peppercorn sauce because it stayed there for a while. In the pan. Well, the actual ingredients needed to reduce with the water we put in. I don't know how um, um, the peppercorn sauce would be overcooked, like what it would taste like, but it tastes great, so I guess it's not overcooked. Medium steaks? My dad has never eaten like a non well done steak in his life. So I came from that family. Okay, leave me alone. Mm-hmm. Medium medium was pretty, pretty. I came pretty far from. What is it? The, the apple comes pretty far from the tree or something like that? I don't know the expression. All right, you going to finish that or what? I mean, no, gonna... your, your meat's dying there, okay? It's dying on your plate. I'm supposed to finish on stream. Oh, are you? Mm, I don't know. No, I don't know. I'm happy to do. Okay. I'm just being polite. <laughs> Here. Anything medium and under is fine. Fine? Excuse me? Okay, someone needs to moderate this individual. We don't use words like fine when it comes to Aranya's impeccable cooking, okay? What do you think this is, a crip stream? Please. Mm. I'm a very loud eater, I'm sorry. I'm intimidated now. I get performance us, anxiety. Oh. Give us a good chew, okay? Mm-hmm. Wait, this should be good. This should be good. Wait. Mm-hmm. We can hear the cholesterol levels rising. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm a loud eater. What can I do? I'm eating by looking at the food. Like that's... I actually ate earlier. I drank water and stood in the <sighs> sun and activated my photo- photosynthesis. Why did she need a thermometer? Did you not see the perfect cook on that steak? You don't need thermometer, a thermometer. If thermometer you is skip. for people who don't know what they're doing, okay? It's yeah. pretty insulting. It's like gifting your wife a vacuum cleaner, okay? This is not cool, dude. It's not cool. Or you can do that and see how it turns out. But, you know, I would warn you against it. 